ball launched in from the corner. Four minutes in, Nicaragua putting a lot of the early pressure on. Crossed in, looking for the handball, and it is called. The ball bouncing up, and Kamar Lawrence could not get his hand out of the way. but doesn't have too much experience Andre Blake here the 24 year old and it's a panic clearance the machine even a few more technical issues with Kamar Lawrence who was one of the bright spots at the Gold Cup but not here so fifth minute and Andre Blake Husky looking to come up big lasted and going the other way Rosas with a short step up Blake could not read it and the underdog Nicaragua with the first bite of the match and take a look Ball in the opening minutes, and he sends the goalkeeper Andre Blake the wrong way. It's a fine taken penalty, has a bit of power behind it, and it just it's Kamara Lawrence. He knows that should have done better on a smooth to the going the other way. And in fact, if anything was frozen, still a good call, a good penalty, and now Jamaica working from behind. Oh, blasted away. Jason Casco to midfield. Now it trickles across for Chavaria. Chavaria to the 18. A low roller off the post. Oh, my. Just like that, they've doubled the lead. What a... Line strike right into the bottom corner. Take a look at that. The defense nowhere to be seen on that side. Kamar Lawrence out of position. And he still has all to do. Chavaria from that position way outside the box. It needs to be placed perfectly. More reserved. Oh, Here look. again, take a look. That's perfectly struck. Couldn't have struck it any better, Phil. Just skirts off the post. Height difference, especially with those front men and the pillars coming up from the back, like Michael Hector. It was Vinny Schaefer's own words saying that not many teams are better than Jamaica from the set piece situation. Good chance now as they pick the ball up, bursting into the goal. Square oh! touched home, given away by Jamaica and rolled in by Galliano. The Cinderella story continues in Kingston. The second half, it's another poor giveaway from Jamaica. This challenge here, nowhere close, and then the ball squared in low, and it beats the entire back line. It's a fine ball played in from, but in the air, and you take it short like that. I really don't understand that as we look at that goal from a surprise. Another chance for Maddox. Drive to the inside, tucks it to the far corner, and Jamaica's finally on the board. Speed kills. Well, in this case, maybe it just keeps...
receiving the ball from the defense. It's a clever little header right into the path of Darren Maddox. One on one against the defender. He twists it. Cuts inside. He fakes going to the outside. The defender bites right there and then twists him inside out and has that window to shoot to that far post. Goalkeeper, no chance there. It's curling. It's from a good position from Maddox. And that's goal number 11 in his Jamaican career. Andre Blake's job for good, or this is just a chance in what was supposed to be an easy match against Nicaragua. Wayne Miller probably doesn't want to get too comfortable on that bench. High in the air, edge of the six, headed down, loose in the six. Another chance for Maddox, still for Brown. Oh. Blasted across, onside, in goal. It's Mariapa, and it's 3-2. So many all to clear it. It's a fine corner swung in here. Doesn't make the clearest of contacts with the ball Maddox and then two three occasions to strike a pass it just gets stuck under Maddox's feet and then the cross finally does come in from Brown and he has an option there at the far post and all it needs is that little tiny touch